How did you breathe that time? Did you do the rocket ship? <sighs> or maybe smelling the rose? Blow out the candle. If I wasn't ringing the singing bowl, I would have picked the lotus flower today because I have most of my flowers here ready to go into the ground. Let's try it. Can you see? I'm covered in paint again today. It's everywhere. I can't wait to get into the shower and wash it out of my hair and my nose and even on my neck. Today I was painting the top part of the porch but on the outside I had to use a really big ladder and I was a little bit scared because I'm a little bit afraid of heights but I did some deep calm breathing and was able to do the job. I was proud of myself. I felt, I felt proud. I am excited because on the long weekend that's coming up, that is known as a planting weekend. So I'm excited to put some of my flowers here into the ground. These flowers have been in my house for about a week, most of them. Uh, a few I picked up at the nursery today. That's a place where flowers live. And it's so nice and warm in houses and in nurseries that if I would take the plants out and plant them right away, that could make them go into shock, which means the leaves might wither and die because they're used to being inside in the warmth and outside at night it's still quite cool. So this week I'm taking my plants for a walk. That's what it's called but it does not mean walking around with my plants. What it means is that in the morning when I get up after I have my first coffee I bring the plants out to sit on the porch all day so they're out in the cool morning air and for the afternoon sun and then the cool evening air but before it gets too cold at night, I bring them back inside. It's also called hardening off. It gets them ready for living outside. And I thought, if we are out here together, why don't we take a look and give some water to the sunflower seeds? When they get bigger, they'll be going outside. Probably not this weekend, because I didn't start them early enough. But they love this beautiful sunshine too. So I'm gonna start by giving them a little bit of water here because we know these seeds need some water so that they can drink up the water and start to wake up. They are germinating. I showed you the other day how one of my seeds had started to grow. Can we see it here? Let's see. It's right here. There's a little, I don't know if you can see it in the sunlight. A little piece coming through but it hasn't popped all the way through yet and even though it's hard to see I can tell you that in this tube there's another little part peeking up and did I see a third one I thought today mm, maybe it's just those two to start hopefully more will come see what happens next I also thought I'd like to share with you a cool little tradition in our neighborhood at 7.30 p.m. in the evening, uh, many people in our neighborhood come out onto their porches and into their driveways with pots and pans and musical instruments, and we make a big thank you noise to the people who are working so hard in hospitals to care for people who are not well. That's what our whole neighborhood, everybody's banging and making noise. It's a nice thing to hear. Listen. All right. It's almost 7.30. I wonder if we'll hear banging. Did you hear that, Jeff? It. I heard it. Someone's already banging. I hear some banging already. Is it our turn now? Do it, Jeff. I hear it too. 
I think Brenda's down that way. Yeah, let's keep going. And I just heard Pat. fun. I enjoy it. This is just going to be a short video today because I've been painting for most of the day. Uh, I still have to bring the plants back inside and clean up my painting mess. But while the sun was still shining, I wanted to sing a quick song with you. Called Sing. Let's sing a song together, shall we? On the title page, it just says Sing and shows us three little birds in a nest. Three little birds. And first we see the teal. Teal is a greeny blue color. The teal bird is having a music note. He's doing a little song. And look at that. He flies away. And then comes the orange bird. She has a little song note also. And then she flies away. And then comes purple bird. And we can see no song note came out. Look at Purple Bird's body clues. He looks sad that his brother and sister flew away and he's stuck in the nest. Poor little bird. Oh, he's trying again. It's good to try and try and practice, right? Nothing. Sad little bird. Oh, look at how sad that bird is. And here comes the child, and the child has a guitar. Sing, sing a song. Sing out loud, sing out strong. Sing of good things, not bad. Sing of happy, not sad. Sing, sing a song. Make it simple to last your whole life long. Don't worry that it's not good enough for anyone else to hear. Just sing, sing a song. La 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 the kids always have such a good giggle in our class when we get to the last part. It's so nice that the little bird kept practicing and trying and then finally he was able to sing and fly away with his brother and sister too. Thanks for singing with me in this gorgeous sunshine. See you next time. <laughs>